Hello everyone, welcome to Microsoft's Imagine Cup Asia Regional Finals 2020. I'm Bobby Tonelli. And I'm Melissa Tan, and today we're in the Microsoft office in Singapore mm -hmm. because it's happening virtually. That's right, this is the Regional Finals where all these students use their imaginations to actually come up with real world solutions. But one of the criteria in this competition is that each team's idea has to be powered with Azure. So Mel, a couple years ago, you were part of Imagine Cup. What was that like? Oh, I really enjoyed it because the solutions that they brought were kind of mind-blowing. I can't believe they came out of such young minds. And I think that's what this whole competition is about as well, harnessing the power of young minds. For the first time in Imagine Cup history, we are doing this challenge completely virtual. I'd be really excited to see that, actually. We're going to talk to some of the people, find out what Imagine Cup's about. We're going to meet the students. So with that, let's get this competition rolling. Yeah. What's up, Pablo? Tell us what is this all about. So yeah, this is the 18th year of the Magic Cup. It's been a, a worldwide competition for Microsoft for 18 years. It's a, really a platform for students to bring their ideas to life using technology. We hope that they can bring an idea to life and bring it to a, a global stage and really want them to know that they can think outside the box. Hello, Jennifer. Hi, guys. This year we had close to 30,000 students participate in over 100 countries. So it's very global, it's very wow. international, it's truly a worldwide program. So we're excited for the Asia final. All right, thanks Jennifer. I really want to see whether the um, projects that they are building serve a target audience and also really solve a pain point, right, that we are facing in this world. This is the 18th year of the Imagine Cup, and we're just thrilled to have these amazing teams here with us and our amazing judges. This is such an exciting day. We're so pleased that you've been able to make it. So we're really looking forward to hearing from the 10 teams who have been selected. Your presentation starts now. This is our Viber IntelliSense sensor. It could easily be prevented using our application site. So it helps in treatment for neurological motor skin disorder. Thank you. Okay, so this is Team Technology for Social Good, focusing on accessibility, diversity, and inclusion. And we've seen some really exciting teams. There's, there's been a lot of good things, and there's been a lot of interesting teams out there, some ideas that I think have some potential. What in Team you took from Japan? I like that the way that they are tackling people that have cancer or they're looking at a medical reason and kind of a solution. For the fact that they can do English and Japanese now, I think that they are on the right path. Team Tulipa. Obviously, I like the way that they're trying to tackle this issue. It's a great, great concept. Obviously, if the right funding, then they can make the products a lot smaller, sleeker, like you said. Team TAZS. Did you simplify this idea? and make it work there and then then size it up, which I think is a very, very good way to tackle this versus then go big and then face all those issues, but start small and then go big. Team uses music. Yeah. We like this. <laughs> we immediately gravitated to that yeah, one. Yeah, <laughs> right? Music that you can be created for you based on what the, the, the your feelings or what you want. I feel like this is something that was the most accessible out of all. Like we could literally yes. download it right now, tomorrow, subscribe and use it. Yes. Team Holo, it really hit me. The story. When you have that story behind it, it drives me. When they're designing the usability of this whole thing. The first world finalist from the Asia regional finals is... Team Holo from Hong Kong! All right! Yeah. I knew that. I knew they would get it. I knew they would get it. From the Asia Regional Finals is Team Newtone from Japan. Team Newtone! Oh my god, congratulations you guys! Congrats! <laughs> what is your strategy going forward when you go to Seattle? Keep doing the same thing. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Hard work. We want to make sure that we hit the ground with our product. We are also going to work on the Azuma software because you had kind of super coming. Thank you for this, yeah. Very good, yeah, friend. I have, yeah. Selfie! Here we go! A huge congratulations to Team Holo from Hong Kong and Team Newton from Japan for winning the Microsoft Imagine Cup Asia Finals. That's right, these two teams will be going to Microsoft Build in May at Microsoft's HQ. Chance to win US $100,000 and to be mentored by Satya Nadella himself. This is amazing. Even if these teams do not win, 
Just this opportunity alone opens up so many doors for them and just an opportunity of a lifetime. I totally agree. It's been great, guys. Thanks so much for joining us. We'll see you next time.